let's take a look at that new exam. So I want, I want to talk about the new uh, NES Essential Sk Academic Skills test, and I want to focus on not just the reading, let's do the writing section of the test today, okay? So let's talk about the writing, All right? So we did the reading yesterday, we'll do the writing today. So that means this one right here is 36 multiple choice questions and one essay. Give me a thumbs up. So the numbers here are 36 and one. What's the timing? The timing is the same for both, whether you take it um, at the test site or at home, it's an hour and 15 minutes. That works out to uh, 75 minutes. Okay, give me a thumbs up. Same rules apply, you can take breaks here, you can't take breaks here. And the passing score is a 220, slightly lower. So let's look at that on the Venn diagram, okay? Uh, on the MTEL exam, the MTEL 01, you have upwards of four hours, maybe three hours to test. On this new um, NES Essential Academic Skills test for the writing portion, because we're doing the writing one right now, it's 75 minutes. Team, do you see the difference in time? <laughs> it's not even close, right? <clears throat> right? It's not even close. Um, you have 35 multiple choice questions here, working at 90 minutes to do this section. You have 36 multiple choice questions here. So it's about the same uh, amount of multiple choice questions. Um, and um, okay, all right. So this would be about 10 passages to get to 35 questions or about 10 or so passages to get to 36 questions. You have seven things here, a short answer and two essays here, and you only have one essay here. So that's actually kind of good, but um, the terms of the pacing that you would have to do, based on these based on these numbers, um, let's say you were to just speed through this this uh, section of the test. So speeding through the multiple choice would be I don't know an hour, right? An hour to to do all this stuff. Um, then you would have uh, 15 minutes to do your essay. Whereas when we did it, we were like the multiple choice. You want to spend 90 minutes on the multiple choice, right? And we were saying short answers, 30 minutes. And then the essay, well, you want to have, you know, you want to have at least um, anywhere from, it's anywhere literally from 90 minutes to, uh, um, you, I'm sorry, anywhere from two hours to um, 70 minutes, but there's a huge difference in time here. I'm not so sure the stuff that we're gonna do today, where we're gonna focus on the persuasive essay and being able to do it in 50 minutes, I don't think I can compress that to a 15 minute thing. And even with the lower score, I'd rather have the extra time uh, on the essays and the multiple choice than this sped up version. Team, do you see the difference? So if pacing is an issue for you, um, be very careful of this new test, all right? Hi team, this is Chris Abraham from Go Academy. This spring, Go Academy is turning all the workshops into webinars. These classes are gonna be covering the same material as a regular workshop. We're gonna do them in seven hours and they're held on Saturdays and Sundays in the morning. I encourage you to check out a webinar. I'm sure you'll find them very helpful.